Make sure they still got some airflow. Looks like the dog's already been checking them out. Uh, the bees, very important to the bees have uh, good airflow through the winter. Um, so the main thing is making sure these uh, top entrances are uh, open and accessible. Um, what I do is I put these uh, little pieces of wood in here, uh, which basically helps uh, keep the plastic from freezing to that uh, inner entrance, which is just behind the, the wood there. Um, yeah, just make sure they... It's over on there, but they're all looking pretty good. Good stuff, ladies. Good stuff. What is that, buddy? What is that? I don't know what that is. Well, sorry for the bad camera work. Certainly didn't look like a coyote or a, um, a wolf to me. Looks a little bit more like a, uh, a cat. But I've been proven wrong about cougars. I know we have them in this area. Uh, but last time I uh, thought I found a, uh, or caught a, uh, Bobcat, it ended up being a uh, black domestic house cat, which is terribly unexciting. That was pretty cool though, whatever that was. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> 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 so 
So this is kind of cool. I'm uh, just in the backwoods here doing some snowshoeing and I've uh, been following uh, some deer tracks, very, very uh, fresh deer tracks. And you can see there must have been two deers and they're basically uh, doing snow angels here. You can totally see the uh, where they lay down and uh, took a rest. Assuming two of them. This is a, a nice sunny spot, I would imagine. Well, <laughs> sun wasn't really out today, but uh, maybe they did this. Uh, I was gonna say maybe they did this yesterday, but the, the tracks are awfully uh, fresh, so I, I think this is uh, from today. Oh dear. So, found another uh, place where deer were bedding down. This one looks like he wasn't getting sun. Looks like he bedded here for the night. Huh. Interesting. Cold bed. This is uh, now a little bit further away from the uh, cabin. I'm up on a, on a ridge. Uh, not far. I can actually see the roof of the cabin just over my uh, shoulder there. Um, and once again, it's uh, I, I'm I'm just I'm surprised how many uh, deer tracks there are out here, uh, like in every direction, like a stampede has gone through. Um, and the interesting thing is that there's uh, I I rarely see deer up here. Uh, only a handful of times have I actually uh, seen uh, deer at the cabin. I've seen them, of course, uh, driving in and out of the cabin. Um, but I'm sure the dog uh, keeps them away. Uh, but yeah, really nice to see all these uh, tracks. It's uh, almost crazy how busy it is back here in these woods. Once again, found another a couple of deer beds. This one right there. One uh, just right behind me. Oh, whose little cabin is this? It's very nice. Uh, one of the very first times I was wandering around uh, from the outskirts of my property. And I uh, was hiking around for a couple hours, really uh, got lost. I wasn't totally lost, I had an idea about where I was, but had no idea that I was so close to the cabin. And I uh, come up this ridge and I see this roof and I thought, oh my God, who's got a place back here? What a beautiful little quiet, peaceful spot. And then I realized it was, <laughs> it was me. <laughs> Chasing the dog.